Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how you could theoretically climb from rank 25 up to field marshal in less than 16 hours. So let's not waste any time and jump right into it. Alright guys, so there's basically only one requirement that you need to yeah, just create the first good deck that you can climb really really well with and over time you just improve it so the requirement is you need us on the progression track on rank 12 and germany because this will give you access to a lot of good cards that are really really good in the deck that we're trying to build it is a us german frontline deck that is heavily relying on here yeah, as it's already saying in the name just having control over the front line and with these two decks that you receive on yeah, level 12 here on the progression track, you can already build a really cool deck, which I'm going to show you right now. So this is the deck we started with. As I said, US Germany frontline. And you have a lot of yeah, just tools to synergize with you having stuff in the front line. Like um the Greyhound being in the front line can buff your backline units like the BF109 can give it additional attack. But mostly you just synergize from the Sherman, which is kind of the key card in this deck together with other tools. But it offers you so much. It gives you a two card draw. It is a 4-4 body, which is completely strong. And yeah, if to maintain this, you have a lot of cards that have the blitz effect, right? You have the Greyhound, you have stuff like the 35T, you have Wilbevind, you have um, First Marines, wherever they are, here are First Marines. You have stuff like the California, which is early in the stages, a really, really strong card because Whenever this is receiving combat damage, it is only receiving one. So it can mostly or very often trade three for one, which is completely busted. Um, obviously pretty weak to, to orders like from the people, which has played a lot in the lower stages. So you mostly just want to blitz it into units that are already in the front line. Whenever you lose it, California is a really strong tool to just regain control of the front line. So your opponent and needs to spend an order additionally, so you get at least a two for one out of this card. Um, and then you just have, yeah, mostly only stuff that fits into the deck that you have access to, but over time you will improve this. Deck. So what do you want to put out over time and what do you want to replace it with? Um, so first of all, when you start on the progression track, like here, over time, you start right here, or you're even more advanced than, yeah, I think from rank 51 on there's, yeah, basically there are repeating. You don't get any diamonds, but you get the wild cards you need. So you get um, a lot of limited and standard wild cards, more than you ever could spend here. Turn uh, level 20, and then I think on 37 and 47, you get special wild cards that you really, really need. And we took a lot of, or a lot of thought process in what we want to craft there and mostly what you want to put out first is stuff like the 81st infantry all the stuff that is not having blitz and not really synergizing with your strategy um 81st then we have the folks grenadiers which are kind of strong but look how many three drops we already have in the deck here we have a lot and we don't want to have another card that is not having blitz and it's not really helping. You could argue this is maybe worse because it's only having four attack, but this is a US unit and you need US units to be in the front line to activate your Sherman drop. So we prefer US units over Germans. So after 81st put out, you put out the Volksgrenade. Stuff like Evoking Giant can go. Um, stuff like gunship mission can go over time 30th regiment can go when you have a better replacement for sure okay that's the car and the bf can also i think from all the cards i mentioned bf maybe has to go last cut in the lower stages of the of the game it is a really strong card 
even if you just play it as a 4-4, it's pretty good. Okay, what to replace it with? Um, first of all, we want to have the first, the fourth Sherman. We only have access to three, so we want to have four of them. Then another really, really strong card is the four credit fifth Rangers. We don't have it right here, but I can show it to you right there. Where is it? There it is. Fifth Rangers. On deployment, you can choose whether to these have zero operation costs and bl blitz it out as a 4-4. Four, four. Or for the latest, later stages of the game, it can also be an 8 8 with 4 operation costs. Really versatile card, really strong in the early game. The zero operation costs are so, so strong. Um, when played on turn 4, you can blitz it to the front line. You can operate it next turn and even play a 5-drop. So one of the strongest cards right now for US Germany. Then, with the special wildcards, so at the moment we only have one 109th combat engineer, so we were thinking about do we put in a second one, do we craft red devils? Um, yeah, I think we all agreed that the red devils card is maybe the better option here, because yeah, in the lower stages players are not really used to it, and there we had some crazy situations where players played. So first of all, I'm going to explain the card. So Red Devils is a one credit blitz unit with three health, and to target this or uh, to target this unit, the opponent needs to spend one additional credit, and that gives you situations like players play a flam panzer on this on turn three, which will obviously not trigger the deployment effect because it will cost them four to target this unit, or if this is in the front line and your opponent is playing 15th cavalry. That is a one credit zero operation cost blitz unit from Japan. It will still cost them four credits to attack two units into this and to get rid of the Red Devils. Um, and that, that is, might be the reason why Red Devils is a really good craft for your first special wildcard that you receive. And even the second copy, I think, had to go to the Red Devils. And you can just replace the 463rd with it. Because they have the same stats, but I think the Red Devil's effect effect is way, way stronger than the 463rd effect. What else do we want? So we agreed on two Californias is enough. If you are in a meta where, yeah, there's just a lot of heavy units that also go to the front line, you might put a third in, but I think Two is the, the sweet spot, I guess. Otherwise, the deck is just getting too slow over time. All right, so this is the deck we started with. We improved it with the cards that I mentioned. And yeah, this is the end result that we just that we just got. This is the deck we reached Field Marshal with. Um, as you can see, it looks really similar. We still have the four Greyhounds. We have two Red Devils in here. Two dive bombings. We also increased our 109 combat engineers to two of them. Um, 335Ts. Yeah, you can just copy the whole deck out of the video description. See what cards you're missing. Replace them maybe with stuff that you definitely had have access to, as I just showed. This deck right here, you will definitely have all the cards out of if you have. Germany and US on rank 12 in the progression track. And yeah, as you can see, not much has changed. We put in fifth rangers, four Shermans, we put in flam panzer and one sun strike to yeah really be a little bit better against stuff like Japan German aggro with the signal regiment, because that card can be really annoying to get rid of. But with sudden strike and flam panzers, we have good tools now. And yeah, that is the deck we actually climbed to field marshal with. One more thing, once you progress to, as you can see right here, we are, wait, relax, rank 49. With rank 49, this is exactly when we hit field marshal. I think we played one or two more games after that just to get to rank 49, where you get an elite wild card. 
So you could improve this deck even further. But I haven't decided was actually out of... Where was this of? I think I got it out of the chest. This is not what I crafted because I still have one US Elite wildcard here. And what you could craft with this once you get to rank 49. PIR is a really good choice. Because, yeah, it's just an additional infantry that synergizes pretty well with the 35T. Plus it can just, yeah, grow out of range and kill your opponent single-handedly if he's not having an answer for this. Also good synergies with Red Devils on board, because you can just buff the Red Devils and every other good infantry unit that you have in the deck. Second could be the Pathfinders. Just came in with a latest expansion. It deals two damage to a unit, and if this unit is destroyed, uh, this unit becomes veteran. On, on veteran status, you can just... At the beginning of each turn, the Pathfinders are bouncing one random enemy unit. If your opponent is only having one guard on board, this is getting definitely bounced. So, a really good deck, a really good card. And I think other than that, on a first, you could think about this, but it's a little bit, it's doing the same thing as the Pathfinders, right? But has a better body and blitz. But honestly, five credits might be a little bit too slow, especially since you have the Californias in the deck maybe that's only the third best option i think the rest is not really great in this deck catalina maybe if you don't find your shermans and you have the feeling you face a lot of discard and yeah you're lacking draw catalina can be a good tool but honestly my to go options here would be would be pir or pathfind so how to play this deck um, obviously, in a mulligan, you're looking for your one drops like the Greyhound, Red Devils, 109s. The best opening, or kind of the best opening that you can have, is one of your Red Devils, Greyhounds, or 35Ts, plus the 109s. The optimal case, you play one of your 1 3 units here um, on turn 1. And then on turn two, you play 109s and push one of those up. So that gives you a two, three into the front line. If it's a Red Devils, it's already a big threat for your opponent. And it can buy you a lot of time to just yeah build an even bigger board to give your opponent's opponent even bigger problems. Um, other things you can do is turn one, you play the 109s and then play 35T. 35T will be a 3-2. You can blitz it instantly to the front line, attack phase, or trade into a one attack unit from your opponent, which gives you a nice two for one trade there and another big advantage for you. Then later in the game or in the mid game, you want to make sure you always have a front line or a unit in the front line. Best case, it is a US unit. So you can synergize or just benefit from the Sherman draw. And that's like your main goal every time. Whenever you're running out of cards or you are on turn three and you want to see, oh, what do I, what do I need to do to have the Sherman draw next turn on turn four? Because Sherman costs four. You kind of want to make sure you're just securing the front line with a US unit so you can play the Sherman. And that is what what the deck is evolving around, maintaining frontline control. And then, if the time is there, you can just close out the game with a blitzkrieg. Half track is really good to get rid of opponent's guard unit. We have a lot of air units right now in the game where the half track is just perfect against. So these tools help you to yeah close out the game. Blitzkrieg really really strong. Also. When you have an empty front line with all these Greyhound 35Ts, 109s that can just yeah give these um, Panzer 35Ts zero operation cost, you can close out the game pretty pretty easy with a Blitzkrieg. So yeah, don't panic when you when it's turn four and your opponent cleared the board. No problem with this deck. Blitz out one of the Greyhounds, play a Sherman. 
the draw and if you have your blitzkrieg just play all of your cheap stuff also hellcat is really really strong with blitzkrieg um yeah just blitz all the stuff out and kill your opponent with this yeah not too balanced card right now i think blitzkrieg one of the stronger cards in the game right now that probably needs a nerf together with other stuff like island defense and kzlo but yeah yeah so this is how you play the game and now i'm going to show you some yeah just some matches so you can get a feeling what you need to take care of how to approach several matchups and yeah if you have any questions just let me know in the comments i'm trying to answer them as good as possible i hope really hope this helps you if you are able to reach field marshal with this let me know i would be pretty happy if i yeah could just help people getting better into the game have just success in it and just get these cool rewards out of field marshal rank right so you don't want to miss that because it's really cool stuff you get here like you get not just this um, card back which is maybe the the yeah what you don't really need but you get four packs and you get a golden elite and for the newer players this is really really good just get a free elite it's really hard to get elite wild cards or to get elites in general so you don't miss that if you start right now as i said it's possible in 16 hours let me know how long it took for you and yeah enjoy the matches enjoy the video and see you on the next one bye with germany i know we have cheap stuff in the deck so can we please it yeah that looks better oh man and maybe the opponent is not moving there that would be also not too good to go into this because this just deals an additional damage to the Panzer 2. So maybe we can sneak this into the front end as a 2-3. Uh, we can't. But it's fine. Definitely doing work here. Bigger than I am, yeah, but only on paper. Don't kill my infantry unit. Having a flump panzer, huh? Lamp Panzer is not good. Oh, look what we can do here. Covers the Flam Panzer pretty well. Let's just hope there's no Nabel Werfer. But then he cannot operate this. So. Lamp Panzer. I think that's the first Flam Panzer we see. Out of draft, I guess. I want to draft earlier. Hurts. Uh, so, several options. We can just deploy M4A1. Or we can use our dive bombing already. Cures the front line. Yeah, I like that one more. Oh, we can't secure the front line actually. Forgot that this is only as one um, attack here. Um, but still. Yeah, maybe M4A1 was better than.
But still not the worst situation in the world here. move so far Ooh. Ooh. the Blitzkrieg. That's really bad. Oh shit. Oh, okay. Yay, Mahiyo! Mahibo? Mahibo? Welcome. Alles schon mir egal. Bro, how many of these bombers do you have? Could go for draw here, but also having that one on board. So, with the next. And wild cards, we just want to draft Germans and we replace those and the 3 6 from Germany. And then we have a really good deck here already. Please post an update bypass deck video. Bypass, is that even a thing? This goes here, this goes there, so maybe we want to have something big on board here. Secure the draw here. Can maybe get a 6-6 six, six BF down soon.
Can't target this with orders, huh? Ooh, that's annoying. Can I find a half track here? Also, where are my Shermans? Wait, do we have lethal here? Three, four, five. Do we spawn? This guy just got introduced to Blitzkrieg. Uh. At least we have something with blitz, we have a two credit removal here, not too good against swordfish and stuff, but the opponent is playing something else. Yeah, now we find a wonder of, huh? Brits are most likely the weakest one to face. Depending on what I play, like naval support decks are kind of hard to beat sometimes, but also the Fusiliers are really strong. But we also have this from above here. Yeah, there's the naval support. Just died to the death from above, huh? Push it up! Oh no, now we have a nice order, sir. So this could have been a 6-6. Six, six. Don't push it up, please. Oh no, no, no real problem. Now we are having a problem. The Greyhound was so important. Just ignore that 6-6 BF. We're targeting that. Kitty Hawk, so I don't get my death from above here, unfortunately. So I have to do this. Otherwise, I could have gone here and then death from above. Hmm, just bad, but. Not too much. Got a lot of stuff into the front down here. We have to show. Let's fit him. Schritt, klar. Rats. Okay. 
I can live with that. Because now we get the sh... I mean... I can just kill this. We go here, here. On the other hand, we have the Sherman draw. Yeah, let's get it in. Puppet bomb next turn. Yeah, that's why maybe Sherman was the better line here. But we could have almost cleared the whole board here. Back into the Rangers. Uh, first Marines, please. No? Yeah, do this. Do this. Do this. No, not there. No, also not there. No. Rangers. Marines, no. Uh... I mean, we can try to hit our 25% here. On that, so the Hellcat is able to kill it. If not, we can still do this. Let's do it. Ah, close. Really, really close. Put that. Hey, Penny, got to see you. Who cares about guarding the HQ and you can guard your units, huh? How many naval support can you have? Especially on the fighter, that's really annoying. What? He's not even protecting the Kitty Hawk. Nice. Wow! <laughs> hey, what was that? Oh, the king. Oh, there are the fuzzle ears. Oh my god, what are, what are we drawing here? Drawing like gods! Put it back for Sherman, just in case there's a carpet bombing. Hey you guys, this stack is, I don't know. I can see myself just going to Field Marshal without losing another match with this. But let's not be too overconfident here. Or some big health units. Puppet bombing would still screw. Yeah, to kill this man. Not take away the draw.
Wait, I had lethal, right? Okay. Let's just ignore that fact, okay? We're doing this for the XP. <clears throat> Also, is enough credits? Well, yeah. So yeah, interesting deck there from the opponent. This is also a pretty strong unit. Five health on a three credit body there. This could be close to achieve it today. Don't Greyhounds. Yeah, I'm not sure what 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 I would craft with this deck as elite. Maybe PIR. Here, or oh, Sky Train, mate. Oh, what is this hand? I block the front line here. Stop expansion. Maybe if I find a three drop now, I can't play it. Maybe I should have pushed up. Oh yeah, the pathfinders are good as well. I agree. Ah, oh, signal regiment. Probably have to hit this with the death from above. So we can achieve this somehow. So if we continue facing those kind of decks, we can also just sneak in one flam panzer into the full deck. Thank you. Oh no. Your meta deck here. Um, can we afford to skip one turn here just for the draw? We really need to improve our hand. But this is the best shot, probably, to remove the first signal. Oh shit! I don't know. That's really expensive. But the opponent does not like it. Yeah, Maybe it was the other play here. First Marines is really a good top deck here, blocking the front line time. Face, hit face. Great. <laughs> Guys in rage mode here. Not like us being in the front line. I don't think he's stream sniping guys. I 
Let's also give him a cool deck because this guy it's probably spent a few dollars here. Yikes. Yeah, now we're sitting here with these staffs in hand. Nothing to activate the Sherman. Oh, I didn't know we have that one in the deck as well. One copy, right? So a lot of things to replace here. But mostly with specials and elites, so... Guy just has a meta deck. What the frick? Was a good top deck. Oh, this will be a close one. This guy's also definitely playing Dragon Slayer. Is the last copy? I think he has one more left. Huh? Oh shit. Oh god. Man, okay, but it saves us some HQ health here. I don't know if he's done. I have a bad feeling about this. It was really helpful that we got rid of the signal regiment. But he can still just put out a shit in and then we have to rely on some high roll fiesta stuff here. This one really helps and also the fifth ranger is activating the 35T. That's my strat bombing. I also just have a Sendai regiment and then just completely swing the game around. Oh, that's really helpful. How do we utilize this the best? Probably like this. This goes to the front, this clears this. Okay, that's a lot of stats he has to go through. 11 HP on Sendai and then it's only 4 back thank you come on just surrender bro with your 
full collection deck. Which I have two last man. I would not be surprised to be honest. Heavy hand here. All right, we have eight, ten, nineteen damage. Are you serious? Oh no, we have twenty, right? This goes to three. Yes. Why? Eh? One of those hands. Really nice sickle there. That was maximum value. Another great sickle. That was that sickle was better. What is this deck about? Looks like Conef deck. Oh wow, it's self damage. Can I find my half track, please? Looks like a nope. I think it's pretty happy about deploying this, huh? Three sickles already. Just imagine we had a half track there. Oh. Okay. Go offensive? Wait, what? Would you not damage the fifth rangers? Ah, I see. Call with raid. 
Hope you had a nice morning walk, Carl. Yeah, just kill yourself, bro. You annoying meta deck. Half track. No half track. We can try to find it. One off. Nice, guys. Okay, hand we want to keep. What about the California? I don't like to see that one. But maybe we hold back the Greyhound here. So it's not dying to 35T. Oh, it's not having it. Okay. Oh, why would you not buff yourself? You are no longer buffing itself. There'll be wind verbling into the front line. Now we have a problem. I mean, next turn we can use the strangers to clear it. trick okay. really good how much value there out of our one else fifth rangers oh naval bombardment nice i like it Bombing feels weak here. Oh, California. So we could bounce it. Then we could still strat bomb and play California here. Oh, that's still. Oh no, that's. Oh no, okay. Mm, that still allows the Sherman play. Yeah, 
to. It's a body on ball, right? Is there anything else that might be more important to bounce? The opponent needs to sacrifice a lot of stuff here. Able to go to the front line, but then there's just another California waiting for them. Let's just hope we stay in the front line here for a while. Really need to draw. Guess we're never staying in the front line here. Oh no, there was a California. Now where I played my harp trick. Uh, maybe. Oh great. Oh wait. Um. Oh shit. I really want to play strat bombing here. Oh no. Yeah, I think we wait with the Sherman. Don't have good answers to Californias. Let's hope there's not another California at plus 5th Rangers, that would be worst case here. Okay, we can live with that. At least we finally get the draw in. Bounce here. Do we go for the bounce? That's an intense one, holy shit. Fine. That did nothing for them. That was kind of nasty. Okay. We found the Blitzkrieg. Hey, Defender. I guess we win now. Thanks to the absolute balance card, Blitzkrieg. Okay. Brits, oh, Brits.
usually annoying to play against. See what Dark Vision is having for us here. Sonia. Hey Colleen, uh, we only had one game so far and it was a really intense one. Your opponent having a 5-5 California on the front line. And we just top deck death from above like a god. That's really playing with air. Darkness, yeah. The brother of darkness. Or is it the opponent? Dark vision. Darkness. Who knows? Or the king. To look for a strat bombing. Stars and stripes. Could have just attacked with the bombers. <laughs> yeah, you could. Not sure why. Maybe. It's annoying. Sonia here. No close air support, please. That's really bad now. We need our, our flump panzer. One helps as well. One flump on the top deck, please. Or half track. We have a few outs here. Another thirty five T will be win.
I mean, you played one air superiority already. Decision bomb, sure. Bad bombing, no, okay, 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 okay. We have to bliss this one out, it's an eight eight. Having another answer, maybe a lightning. Oh shit! You're done. Come on, stars and stripes, please, once in a lifetime. Do it. least something and damage we need to do this maybe on the bomber on the half track Well gone, nice. Hey Flavinator! Monty Schmonty. Okay, well we can give our HQ smoke screen next turn. Leave another seven here. Okay, opponent doing the trade, so we're definitely going to bounce this one. He can do it. Oh, if you could just find stars and stripes, holy shit. So a little bit too late. Ah, probably too late. But he needs to do some trades now here. Monty was already played. The other Albacore got um, discarded from the naval supply run. Able to kill the flam panzer with this. We can bounce the buffalo if he's not trading into this. We're not in the worst spot in the world here.
Yeah, first Marines is so good against backline decks. Okay, that was a straight there. Guy has to. <laughs> oh, okay. Why you always be like that? Always like that, right? Right the turn after we clear the wall, we top take this. Oh, he's spinning that, huh? Oh, he's killing that. German? Oh, yes. So this is two, seven, eleven. I think I want to keep my US units in the front line. In case we draw another Sherman. So this is having one operation cost. Finding a land lease, Mr. Dark Vision, huh? Oh, the king, holy shit. And this deck is somehow missing the punch, like. What? Fortification? Denying lethal here. Nice. Britain, not Britain again. Ah oh, man. Okay, but this hand is okay. Too fancy, but also not too bad. Can you share the deck list, please? Sure. Remind me after the match. So just before the match ends, please. Because if it's just finished, I might just queue into the next one. That T, that T was supposed to look better, right? But maybe they needed to optimize it for for mobile it's looking like like wood i don't know the wood looks better than the tea just give it a texture like this it does not need to move but <laughs> all this tea is too much milk right oh hydra come on i have a medipack going here Oh, 
Oh no, it's this garbage again. Okay. I would love to see bird air, honestly. It looks like we're just facing credit denial again. Just wait for Monty supply short. I need to kill it instantly. It's a second honey. This. At least not credit denial, but. How do I kill that? I mean, no need to kill if you can just bounce it. <laughs> oh, we can do it as a good find. So it's this card, probably? That's a good one. God, we're so weak to carpet bombing now. Oh, and we found a third one. Yoo Come on, play it again. Do we ever bounce it again? Let's go. Maybe at some point in the near future we find we find a blitzkrieg here. Hey, that's the third bounce. That guy just wasted 15 credits on nothing. No supply short. No blitzkrieg. Might be too late for that. Oh, man. Just all in on Blitzkrieg. Yeah, three time bounce. <laughs> oh, yeah, please. Yeah, nice. Now we lost. What do we want to give him here? Nothing, I guess. We just pass?
Four credits? What is a four credit order in our deck? That's from Valve. Oh, okay, yeah, that's correct. I don't want to give any of my units to this guy here. And steal red devils now and this. What do we found threat bombing? Oh, he's being greedy, guys. Probably activating Ultra here. Oh, thank you for that. Thank you for that value. Guy's not playing the best game in the world here. We can do it. Three credits. Oh, he got a Blitzkrieg. Interesting. Triple fifth rangers here. Problem is we cannot really overextend into this guy. With monsoon rut supply shortage. I'm <sighs> just wondering what the wind condition is. Not my Hellcat. Oh man, it was the Hellcat. Oh, perfect top deck. That's why my bar feels really strong in some situations. Oh, what? Are you kidding me? challenges I had a feeling that it was entrapment but I really like the idea don't tell me he has another one don't freaking tell me okay That, that almost, I mean, we can still lose here, but. Would have almost lost us the game instantly here. Yeah. 
any monsoon rod, huh? Wow. Thank Lord. Mint. He's playing US. He's playing US. Okay, so we have at least equal chances. That's now depends who's going first. Who's having the better starting hand? We go second. Do we want 109s when we go second? Probably not. But in case they're playing ramp, it's really good. Okay, we found Red Devil. Wow, this hand. He also, he's also playing a fast deck. Yeah, okay, that is a slow start for them. Which I really appreciate. We can't attack this with 35T. was already annoying. This will make it 2-3 out of that, oh man. Oh, I would love to have a flam panzer here. Bro, what did he do? I find it so annoying that you can play this actually. Like, <laughs> the game is just letting you target this and then it's just being played without doing anything. Oh man, poor opponent. Did he lose the game because of that now? I mean, it's far from over here, but... That was a big, big oopsie for the opponent. This being a 2-3 is really annoying. Fun. Okay, this goes here. Hope he can't go to the front line. That's the most important thing here. The game doesn't let you target? I think it does. Because it did the same mistake as well. My god, that's really, 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 really good. It already paying out that we just use our um, wildcard here. Um, wait, that was what I wanted to do. Could have played 35T, then I could have pushed this one up as well. Ah. Uh. Not so good. There was a little throw on our end here. Yeah, I also should have killed this. I forgot about the effect that it had the. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, but he bounced that one. So we have. Kind of a restart, you know. Okay, now let's focus. This is giving plus one. If we bounce, the effect is gone. California, guys. Oh, 
can we do against California? We need our own California here. Come on, please, stars and stripes or strat bombing, please. Mm. Imagine. Just imagine. That's two. I don't have an infantry unit, that's what he said. I mean, or Dressing me. Let's just hope he's not having we can do it. If he's having we can do it, we lose here. Long Tom, okay. The longest of all the Toms. Needs to be killed, I guess. We just ignore the one B. Okay, I have an idea. Here. This goes there, we just ignore that one. Hopefully we can kill it next turn. Yeah, just, just try a few more, Mitch. Oh no, shit, that's bad. Need the death from above. Long Tom. Okay, they survived. That's really important. Oh, my God. That's five, five. Guys, this just feels like the world championship here. Final game. Game five of the World Championship. Boost has two units in the front line, three units in the front line. Can he find a strat bombing? 
That's the biggest question here. The opponent is desperate. Opponent is desperate. Just push everything to the front line, right? Oh. oh, first try. Nice. Oh. So happy about this. Oh, can't imagine. Whew. That was that was really, really intense. Holy moly.